Welcome everybody to today's video. This is episode 5 in the AppGyver series. In today's episode, we're going to talk about the change that have been done in AppGyver recently uh, to do with the layout. Um, I got a lot of questions about people asking, so why does my, my app look different, my MacGyver workbench looks different than the one you're showing on the video it's because i was using an older version and today i'm gonna redo the fashion app i made uh, in my last video i'm gonna now um, adapt it to the new layout which they've built so so let's dive in there it's for me also a bit of exploration it's also new for me so let's see how it goes So this is my old travel app, so um, we're not going to do that one, we actually can do the fashion app here. So let's start into that. And you first get a warning about um, that you need to install updates, so let's do that first. Um, because there's a newer version, so a lot of things there. Just update all, okay. So update all the different. Uh, theming changes and stuff like that, especially around theming, what looks all exactly the same. So that's how it currently looks. So you will see when we start to go more into detail, you see actually things are going to change slowly and uh, we'll hopefully put it back to where it was again. So, so let's do that. Let's hide the app and let's go. So let's see. So we have to go one by one to see what has been done there. So let's look at the the, bo the bottom one see this one changes now to the style the gap and the bottom these are the main changes in the layout we're talking about and here you can see here already uh, lexi value stretch value in um in usually line components uh, which cause erratic wild high behavior please select one of the values before uh, after doing note you might need to tweak the widget height behavior of the component inside so so let's do that one onto the new column. I don't think we want to do that. And then uh, we just need to here press the button migrate. This hasn't done much of what it is now. So at least I can save this one. Just fix me at least one already. Um, I to see I do saw a bit of change there so now I want to full width growth I'll save again and this is exactly what happens now you can see now I have like actually a whole bottom which is not there anymore so um, yeah so we need to start fixing those kind of problems also so just quickly switch this off which is in um, where is it again in community and I know so I'll switch this off go back again here so I can see this gap now standing there which we don't want um, we want to do that one um, we get everything to one place what we really want. you can see now things are <laughs> start to slowly fall apart so um so let's save this one and start to uh, start fixing this problem we're currently having so some of the things are okay other ones are not that nice so so let's just start with these ones again and everywhere you see now changes have been done so in the last time what we want to do is to at least stretch it again you can see again here so let's do that one and then we want to stretch this one out to the top which is great and we want to grow to the full width side so that's you can see now that crosses now the whole thing what we want to do which is great so that's a good start so let's go to the navigation bit again we wanted to grow both oh, that is a good fit that starts exactly look like a, what we want to do so let's press save that one already so at least that bit is now stretched nice lightly the icons are it's not much really want to change there so for the statistic now again 
same kind of thing I want to auto align on left hand side so I'm gonna grow them to the left and there we go and we can start to slowly see the new and I'm now looking back at the at the app so it starts to look like what we want it to be so let me show quickly what the original idea was so it's it starts to collect but it's still we don't have that stretch yet what we want to do so let's look, look at that bit first again and see how we can fix that bit so we need to look at this background thing because we want to we want to grow this one we want to fit the content it doesn't still doesn't really fit what we want to do um, that's we definitely want to do the vertical one so that's not really changing so let's look in here what we can do here so we definitely want to stretch this viewpoint which is interesting that it actually doesn't stretch to the viewpoint so let's see so these are the two so let me check so Let's just first fix this to see if there's any any other problem we can fix with. So let's look at the layout here. So again, um, I want to fit the content. Yes, I want to save that one too. So that has been much, much changed to this, but there are these two and that one I want to add Fans. I want to grow this one so let's see if that's the one and that's exactly what we needed to grow it so we press save and now if we now look at the the design so let's go back to show you the design oh, really in design so now you can see we're back to kind of where we were uh, with a nice I think there's still a bit of a um, still a thing what I don't like so I still oh that's interesting um, I can press this and that covers the whole thing but if I do advanced and do this one then I get this really fine line on the side it's hard to see it, but you still can see it so let's see if, if this fix it by moving this to 100 percent i think this is the one let's save that one oh, there's still this little line there um percent again 100 percent and now if you now look now you actually can see it, it goes from uh, screen to screen so this is exactly how it was this is what i wanted to be so a couple of small changes you can see there's a different definitely a different layout now um hopefully it is explained to you why um your your app looks different than mine it has nothing to do with the app i also use the free one um, it's just that they have added a couple of changes here this whole space here this layout stuff is all changed now but it's working now so i fixed my app now that's what i want to do Thank you for watching the videos. If you like this video, uh, give, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of these videos, please subscribe to my channel. It will really help me. All right. Thank you very much. See you in the next video.